From uh, our perspective, uh, we're a company which is based in the Czech Republic, heart of Europe, and the majority of our production and of our sales is located and is uh, realized in Europe. So uh, we're very happy to feel that the European automotive market uh, is actually uh, growing again after quite some difficulties. Uh, we believe that uh, Europe and Central Europe has a huge potential in automotive because of a huge supply base, OEMs base, uh, very qualified people, a uh, lot of investment in R&D. So we think this is really the region which has a big potential in, uh, in Europe and worldwide. Central and Eastern Europe uh, in automotive industry is uh, performing uh, better and better since uh, the 2008 and 9 crisis, but uh, still uh, it lags behind uh, the period before the crisis. At least in Hungary it's uh, true, even double true, because uh, 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 for instance, Magyar Suzuki could produce uh, almost 300,000 cars uh, in uh, 2008, just before the crisis, uh, uh, but uh, today we can use only around 60% uh, of our capacity. I think uh, still uh, the C company countries are uh, keeping the uh, co industrial competitiveness in terms of the uh, labor quality and also feasible cost. And uh, also we have, uh, as we said in my presentation, uh, there are uh, good infrastructure and also supplier network uh, and also uh, the governmental management is uh, acceptable level. That is uh, the still uh, strong point of the uh, Central European area for the uh, industrial development. The automotive industry in Central Eastern Europe is definitely the growth engine of uh, the economies of all the states. Uh, uh, for the Czech Automotive Association, I'm very happy to say that the Czech automotive industry has grown uh, significantly last year and it's growing this year again. Uh, we believe to produce uh, about 6% more passenger cars uh, and go uh, over 1.2 uh, million passenger cars per year. Ago, many of the suppliers after 1990s started to invest in Eastern Europe. And at that time, the main attractiveness of this area was uh, low labor cost, which will bring some competitiveness. But as everybody uh, realized now, the gap between this low labor cost versus the uh, European standard, the gap is very close, and that's why. Uh, it shouldn't be seen as a uh, competitive benefit and we expect all the suppliers to focus on more productivity improvement uh, much more than ever before.
I think the uh, Central and East European automotive industry is performing extre extremely well. Uh, when you see uh, the growth, which is in the range of uh, uh, five to six percent uh, on the on the production, uh, the registration figures go down uh, double figures. Uh, so in most of the countries, uh, the industry is doing very well, uh, especially in uh, countries like uh, the Czech Republic and Slovakia. But the Poles are coming back, the Hungarians also, uh, and the Turks uh, without any doubt.